Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week, and we're just moments away from kickoff time. Stay tuned for the live action. It is a city where passion for football is red hot. Welcome to Naples in southern Italy. Derek Ray here on the commentary box, joined as always by former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. I'm greatly looking forward to bringing you live coverage of this match being played in Serie A. It's Napoli up against Lazio. Well, thank you, Derek. Glorious atmosphere here. Really looking forward to it. The fans are too. The players look like they're up for it. This could be end to end. We could get goals today, Derek. Here's the team for Napoli. David Ospina, the Colombian, is the goalkeeper. Kalidou Koulibaly plays alongside Kostas Manolas in central defence. Fabian plays alongside Piotr Zielinski in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Here are the players who will start for Lazio. The evergreen Pepe Reina stands between the posts. Stefan Radu plays with Francesco Acerbi in central defence. Sergei Milinkovic-Savic plays with Lukas Leva in central midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. Very much looking forward to this contest. And Napoli get the proceedings underway. Zielinski on the ball Bakayoko well they couldn't hang on to it Napoli can he find the net but it can't get through No yellow card, instead a firm warning from the official. And in it goes, as coolly as you like, never in any doubt from the spot. Well, let's have a look again. It seems like an easy job to score from 12 yards out, but I can tell you, I've missed a few in my time. I've scored a few, mine, Derek. Well, Napoli get the game restarted. Will that goal have the effect of stinging them into action? Well, that's not textbook defending. Oh, it's a penalty in the opinion of the referee. And maybe they'll be able to level this up. Well, that could be his final rebuke, I think, and the referee's making that absolutely clear. Well, I like that, Derek. Good refereeing. 
nice and strong, told the player exactly what he was thinking. And the penalty is converted, a goal it is, and now he can exhale. Well, here's the replay, and he's taken with such confidence, right in the top corner and never in any doubt. Great spot kick. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. Patrick. Immobile now. Milinkovic Savic. And the shot decidedly lacking accuracy. Well, he had other options as well, but he chose to shoot. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Immobile, it might be the moment to get them ahead. Can they stop it going in? And in at the second time of asking, but the goalkeeper badly at fault. Well, here's the replay, the keeper's made a save, but it's not good enough, it's back into play. But he was first to react and it's in the back of the net. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Well, the scoreline doesn't favour Napoli. Let's find out about their attack now. Ciro Immobile. Zielinski. Ozimhen. Patient build up at the moment. He's in with a chance. Teammates available and able to get a body in the way. Now Bakayoko, what's he going to do here? One block after another. Lozano. An alert piece of defending. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, listen to that, Derek. They think it was a nailed-on pen. The ref didn't know. Opportunity here. It's been aimed towards the front first. They might regret that miss. They ought to be two up. Well, they've done so much work to get one goal ahead. Two goals ahead was there on a plate, and these fluffed his lines. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. Oh, well, far from the ideal pass. Immobile. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. Strong but fair tackle. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? Will it be sufficiently imaginative? He's in behind. Well, he saw the whites of the keeper's eyes and the whites of his outstretched gloves. Great goalkeeping. Well, he's denied a certain goal there. Great reflexes from the keeper. 
And now that play has stopped, the referee can administer the booking. And taken short. Sends it back. It has to be. No shortage of excitement. Level again. No wonder they're excited. Well, here's the replay. Great disguise on the pullback cross and the thunderous strike to beat the keeper hands down is absolutely brilliant. A chance to revisit the goal. again the sides are level it's a kaleidoscope of shifting emotions well Derek both teams have had equal amounts of the ball both possession stats should be the same the defense is nicely saved a chance to nudge in front corner kick here Played into the center of the box. I'm sure, you know, he wishes he could have that header back. Well, in that position, you should think he's going to score. But it's really a poor effort with his head. electronic board lets the fans know three minutes of stoppage time there to win it back and well, the attacking options appear plentiful and he's given a corner they referee And firing it into the area. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. Well, simply staggering from Chiro Immobile in that first half. And Lee, I wonder what you made of his contribution. Much looking forward to this contest and Napoli get the proceedings underway. And in it goes, as coolly as you like, never in any doubt from the spot. A goal is his, and now he can exhale. Milinkovic Savic. And the shot decidedly lacking accuracy. Well, he had other options as well, but he chose to shoot. Immobile. It might be the moment to get them ahead. Can they stop it going in? And in at the second time of asking, but the goalkeeper badly at fault. The 
They might regret that miss. They ought to be two up. Well, they've done so much work to get one goal ahead. Two. Immobile. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. And taken short. Sends it back. It has to be. No shortage of excitement. Level again. No wonder they're excited. Nicely saved. A chance to nudge in front. Corner kick here. You know, he wishes he could have that header back. Well, in that position, you should think he's going to score, but it's really a... Well, he's given a corner, the referee. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. And they keep things ticking over nicely with Insigne. And what's he going to do? Zielinski. And he's gone into an illegal position, unfortunately. Fabian and fed forwards. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Milinkovic Savic. He's lost it. And space for them here on the flank. Oh, big chance. Zielinski. And a goal to delight the fans, just what they were hoping for. Well, here's the replay. He didn't panic, did he? Decent strike, good technique, bread and butter strike, really. But it's in the back of the net. Well, let's have another view of that goal. So underway once more, advantage Napoli here. Victor Ozimhen. Fabian. Can he finish this? Good defending to prevent the chance. Fabian. Well, possession seeded. Well, Derek, they're not happy. Ref is taking the brunt of this. Lucas Leiva. Well, he could run onto it here. On and on he goes. Another well, opportunity from the corner to get right back into this one. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Corner kick played in. The end product just wasn't there. And the emphasis is on creativity. He's in here. Great work defensive. Could be. There it is. Two to the good now. And that gives them a buffer.
Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Time for a change then. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Napoli controlling possession, really starting to dictate the tempo of this game now. And they're creating chances as well. I'm not sure their opponents seem to have the answer, to be honest. They can't seem to get a foothold in this game. Offside the decision. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Con il numero 10, Luis Alberto. Entra con il numero 16, Marco Parolo. 15 minutes remaining. And giving it away. Wonderfully weighted pass. Well, a badly timed run, just a fraction offside. Insigne it needs an accurate cross sends it back in it goes to rubber stamp it once and for all well as we see from the replay it's a classic pullback cross that sets up the chance and the thunderous strike to beat the keeper hands down is absolutely brilliant. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Francesco Acerbi. Playing with purpose and control. Chances on. Ball is loose. Not a time for cool heads. Ozim Hen. Insigne. Well, he certainly wasn't offside by a mile. C'è il cambio per la Lazio. Lascia il campo. Con il numero 17, Ciro Immobile. Dentro, con il numero 20, Felipe Caicedo. And only two minutes remaining here. Opportunity it is. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, let's see that again. Once he gets into his stride, he just strolls past players. What a lovely solo, wonderful effort this is. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? scoreline we see all that often 5-3 Lazio in goal con il numero 20 Felipe Caicedo Hisai he 
And now Zielinski. And unable to keep the ball. Lozano. So there we have it, the referee says. Enough is enough, and Napoli get the victory. Their fans around the world will be delighted with this league. Yeah, their two-goal advantage in the end was just reward for their good play today for me. Worthy winners. Well, his performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Lee. Well, clearly the difference between the two sides today. Two goals, a really good performance, ran into the channels, did everything right. Absolutely, 9 out of 10.